Hello everyone, this is Megumi from Artec. Welcome to my science class. Today I'd like to show you one of our bestseller products from Artec. Hands-on tools for creating beautiful hands-on products. 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 Hands-on tools for So let's see what's in the box. In the box, we'll have a car body, a gear case, a drive rail, two rear wheels, two front wheels, an air tank, a cap, two rubber bands, two syringes, a short axle with gear, a rocket, a front axle, a long axle with gear, and study guide. So now your pressure power car is ready for experiments. You will also need a tape, a measuring tape, a stopwatch from home. Push the drive rail in and let go to make it run. But do you know why does the air pressure power car run such a long distance? Let me explain the science to you. By inserting the syringe and pushing the plunger, the air inside the syringe is forced into the tank. If you push in the plunger of the motion syringe and then release it when there is lots of air in the tank, the air inside the tank will push the plunger back out. This power transmits to the wheels through the gears and make the car run. So now let's do the speed comparison experiments. For this experiment, you will need your pressure power car, a stopwatch, a tape, and measuring tape. We will supply different amount of air to the tank and measure the speed of the car. Set the start and finish lines on the floor. Set the target of 2 meters. It's about 6.5 feet. Use the measuring tape if one is available. Place your pressure power car at the start position. Record the time it takes for the car to reach the finish line. But why did the speed change? Let me explain the science to you. The air inside the tank pushes the plunger back out and makes the car run. So when a small amount of air is supplied to the tank, the power will be weak and the car will be slow. On the other hand, when a lot of air is added to the tank, the air inside becomes tightly packed. The greater the amount of tightly packed air, the faster the car can run because of the higher pressure. A greater amount of air can drive the car faster towards the finish line. Explore the pressure power car from our hands-on lab series for more exciting experiments and fun facts from our study guide. I hope you've enjoyed learning about air pressure today. Thank you very much for watching. Please remember to like the video, subscribe, and leave the comment below. See you in the next video. Bye!
Oh, my God.